The Adjust Colors tool in Pixelmator Pro contains 17 individual adjustment options. We can see all of them by clicking the Add button up here. Just check or uncheck the adjustments to add or remove them from the Tool Options section below. We're not going to be going over how each of these adjustments work in this tutorial. This lesson will be a general overview of how to use the Adjust Colors tool. Currently we have the histogram, white balance, and lightness adjustments. These are the current default set for the adjust color tool in any image. I also like to include the hue and saturation adjustment in my default set. So after that's added, I just need to choose save as default from the add menu. As these adjustments are made, we can click and hold the Show Original button to quickly hide the adjustments and see the effect that it's had. And we can click Reset Adjustments to go back to where we started from. Be careful though, because if we make an adjustment, we're able to reset it right now. But if I go use another tool on this layer, say the Repair tool, After using that, when I come back into the Adjust Colors tool, the Reset button is grayed out and can't be clicked. I have to undo the work I did with the Repair tool to then undo the color adjustment. So that's why it's a good idea to make changes with each individual tool on their own layer. In this case, I'd need to create a blank layer, do the work with the Repair tool on there using the Sample All Layers option, and that would leave the color adjustments on the edit layer able to still be hidden or reset. When you reset color adjustments, the tool options will go back to the default list of adjustments. The adjust color presets are combinations of the available adjustments and their settings. Click on a preset to apply it to the image. Notice in Tool Options, all the adjustments used in the preset are displayed and can be changed. We can even add, hide, or remove adjustments. If I choose the Vivid preset, notice that as soon as I make a change to one of the adjustments, the highlight around the Vivid preset is removed. If I click on Vivid again, the highlight returns, but the changes that I made are moved back to the Vivid preset locations. To remove a preset adjustment from an image, just click on it again, or click on the None preset here at the top. If I make some changes to a preset, and then I want to save that as its own preset, I just need to click the Add button here at the bottom of the presets. I can then give it a name, and if I move to another image, that preset can be applied. So presets can be created from scratch by adding individual adjustments one at a time. Or a new preset can be saved just like we just did by starting with one preset, changing it, and saving that as a new preset. So the Adjust Colors tool is one that you might use quite often in Pixelmator Pro. Whether it's just with a quick application of a preset, or by adding adjustments one by one on your own to get the exact look that you want. Remember, to quickly jump into the Adjust Colors tool, press the A key. Next, we'll look at the very similar Effects tool.